Hi, my name is Marshall, and this is the story of the time that I played Skyrim for so long that I hallucinated. Everyone has a game that they played as a kid that really blew their mind, and for me that was Oblivion. I was 16 years old and a sophomore in high school when it was announced that a sequel would be coming out, and my friends and I all agreed that we'd play together on launch day, November 11th, 2011, which happened to be a Friday. The day came around, and I sat through every class period just thinking, God, get me out of here, I want to play Skyrim so bad. I even had my grandmother pick up the game for me at the store so I didn't have to waste time after school. When the last bell rang, I hopped in my 2004 Toyota RAV4, that I still drive today by the way, and broke every speed limit on the way over to my friend Connor's house. His basement started filling up with people and power strips. Every five minutes, a new guy would pop up with an Xbox, power cables over their shoulder, a copy of Skyrim still wrapped in the plastic, and a tiny television, like the cube kind that you keep in your attic that inexplicably weighs like 80 pounds. I think at max capacity, we had nine battle stations going. Then catering arrived and we started playing. I played a Khajiit Hunter my first playthrough because that's what I played in Oblivion, and I started to really lose track of time. People gradually started to fall asleep in their chairs, but I kept going. Night turned into morning, morning turned back into early afternoon, and I was still awake, still playing. At some point, I got up to go to the bathroom, I fumbled around for the light switch a little bit, turned it on, and saw a tiny person sitting on top of the toilet. A few seconds later, I realized that I was looking at a painting of a tiny person, and that was my brain signal to me that I probably played enough Skyrim for the day. My favorite part of the story, though, is that I still play games with those same friends today, just for much more healthy periods of time, I would say.